So, we're going to work on temperature conversions because this is a, a fun and instructive way of learning some programming basics. So start your Ruby interactive console and I'm going to load a text file where I have typed a very simple conversion formula that converts from Fahrenheit to Celsius. I've demonstrated to you how to load a file, a text file, from um, a directory in your computer. And the text file is called um, conversion underscore temperature underscore zero one dot rb. That dot rb is the Ruby extension, as you know. So here's the text file. 10 has been assigned to Fahrenheit and but right here I'm going to change it to 90 the first run as you could see return Celsius equals negative 13 given a Fahrenheit value of 10 when I change that to 90 it returns Celsius equals 32 okay very well I could go back into the text file and change Fahrenheit again and I'll get obviously a different Celsius value. From the console I can assign the integer 10 to a variable, variable Fahrenheit. And when I type the variable variable Fahrenheit Ruby returns what it stores which is 10. Very well, I could also directly type into the console the conversion formula and you might expect that you could type it this way given that Celsius equals Fahrenheit minus 32 times 5 divided by 9 when you do it in this manner you get negative 7 back supposedly representing Celsius okay if I go into the text file and type in 10 assigned to the variable Fahrenheit I load oops sorry this didn't load the file. This will load the file with a given Fahrenheit value of 10 and it returns negative 13. So there's a discrepancy, right? discrepancy here. Negative 7 versus negative 13. Which one is correct? Well, the negative 13 is the correct value for Celsius. The mistake committed here is has to do with order of operations. When you type in the formula in this manner, as I'm doing so right now, you get negative 7 back, but that's an error. Remember with order of operations, in this case, first 5 divided by 9 will be evaluated, and then that will be multiplied times Fahrenheit minus 32. In order to correct this, you need to force the operation in this manner, right, with parentheses, so that what's inside parentheses occurs first and then that's multiplied times 5 divided by 9. 